Welcome back to VKQ, Interest and Adventures. So, this video here is because we've been doing a series with Quinn's collection of Pokemon. And she gets to keep them all, and I'm a little bit jealous, because I like Pokemon too. Well, I love one Pokemon in particular. I love Jigglypuff. Jigglypuff makes me happy. So I decided to get a binder, and I am going to go on a journey, a quest if you will, to make the very best Jigglypuff binder in the world. So before we do that, I want to show you some of my other little Jigglypuff things I've gotten recently, and uh, then we'll cue in on this binder. Check this out. Burger King toy. Got a Jigglypuff bag clip. Mech Construct Jigglypuff. My Jigglypuff keychain. And I got two of these Burger King Pokeballs with the gold Jigglypuffs inside. Pretty excited about that. All right, guys. And this one can't go in the binder, so I'll show it off. The very first Jigglypuff printed. Well, not necessarily the first one off the line, but the very first series. So I have Japanese Jungle Mint 9 Jigglypuff. All right, guys. Stay tuned, and we're going to get the very first page of the Ultimate Jigglypuff binder built. All right, guys, welcome back. So for my Jigglypuff binder, I'm going to be using this vault binder. Pink, of course, because Jigglypuff. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, open up the binder. And you guys are going to join me as I build the very first page of the Ultimate Jigglypuff Binder. Alright. Alright guys. So, the way I'm looking at this for my Ultimate Jigglypuff Binder is center card first. I think center card first we should go with a Japanese Jungle. So we're going to go Japanese Jungle for the center. Actually, I want to keep them in the sleeve. Hold on. All right. All right. So. I decided for this first page, we're going to do all the same artwork, but it's not all the same card, because check this out. We are going to go next with our basic Jigglypuff right here, our English set, our 1999 set jungle. I got a few of these and I forgot my sleeves. Hold on guys. Mm -hmm. I know I got some sleeves over here. All right, let's sleeve this up. All right, put that in the binder. All right, how's that looking right now? Okay, now check it out, guys. Same one, but this one's German Plumeloof. 
That's right. In Japan, he's Purin. Here, he's Jigglypuff. And undoubtedly in uh, Germany, Plumapluf. <laughs> so we're going to put him. Uh -huh. There we go. Now, see, I got the jungle. Let's go. with another English version, but base set. We're gonna put the base set one down here. It's coming along nicely. All right, check this out, guys. I have This Jigglypuff. But we got it in Scandinavian. So, uh, go to Scandinavian. Jigglypuff. Now, in this binder, I'm hoping to get one of each type of artwork. Not necessarily every card, but one of each type of artwork. And I want to have at least one in every single language that they release Pokemon in. And I believe they release Pokemon in 12 countries or 12 languages. All right. We're going to put the Scandinavian one here in the bottom. All right. Check that out. Now this one here is another foreign language one. Gotta get it open real quick. If I can get the card out, that'd be nice. All right. In France, Rondodo or Dudu. I'm not sure. You tell me if you speak French, because I have no clue. But we got a French Jigglypuff. All right. So I'm going to take this other Jigglypuff here from base set, sleeve it up. We're going to put him on the other bottom corner. Awesome. And we're just going to finish this page off with a couple more jungles. Which is the first English Jigglypuff. All right, guys, the very first page of the Ultimate Jigglypuff Binder is complete. On this page, we have one, two, three, four languages, right? One, two, three, four, five languages. That's awesome. So stay with me guys and join me on my Jigglypuff journey because in this binder, I'm not going to just stick with Wizard of the Coast and actual licensed Pokemon stuff. I'm going to put sketch cards in here, all sorts of goodness that not every binder is going to have. 
there's going to be rares and ultra rares and illustration art rares and there's going to be different artist renditions from different artists i even going to make my kiddo draw me a jigglypuff we're also going to put in a bunch of non jigglypuff cards where jigglypuff is in the background and we're going to find play games of peak that puff all right guys stick with me you're going to love this all right like share and subscribe